Hello, hello, it's Dumplet here. Here's an item on combinatorics. How many ways are there from A to B? You can only move up and right. As usual, pause this video if you'd like to give this item a try. But if you're done, let us dive into the solution. Now, there are probably a lot of ways to solve this item, but the way I know, like the standard technique of solving this item, is kind of unique and nice because well the first thing we have to do is just to label all the possible intersections and I'm gonna highlight them in red dots as you can see here on the screen now for every red dot I'm going to calculate like the total number of ways that I can reach point B so let's focus on um, this red dot for example how many ways are there from this point to B? There's only one. You can only move right because you can't move down nor left. So these two are not viable options. So there is only one way from this point to reach point B. So I'm gonna write here one. The same can be said for this point, this point, and this point. Because you can't move down, you can't move left, you can't go up. There is only one way, which is to the right. So all of these points, I'm going to assign them 1. Now same can be said for these three points because you can't move to the left, you can't move down. So same for this one, there's only, you can't move down as well. This one, we can't uh, move left. So the only way to go is just to go up. So from this point, there is only one way, which is to go up and there's only one way to reach B consequently. So I'm going to put 1 and same for these two points. Now how about for the rest of the points? It's actually not that difficult to get as well because all I have to do is sum up some of these numbers. For example, this point. How many ways are there from this point to point B? Now first I can move upward and move rightward and I'm going to hit this point which I know there is only one way to go from this point to point B and I can or alternatively I can go to the right and hit this point which I know there is one way from this point to go to point B so like I can assign this point uh, two because there's all there are there's a total of two ways to go from this point to point B you can actually draw it out it's either this route or this route so that this is a technique that we're going to use so for example this point over here I can move up or to the right. Now, if I move up, I have one option because this uh, this point or node over here, there's one way from this point to go to point B. And that's the first option. And the second option, if I go to the right, I'm going to hit this point, which has two ways from getting from, point, uh, from this point to point B. So this point, I can assign this point a value of 1 plus 2, which is equal to 3. So there are three ways from this specific point to point B. Now I can draw it out right right now. So this is the first one, this is the second one, and this will be the third one. And all we have to do is just continue this until we reach point A. Because if we get if we are able to write a number for A, which is going to be the total number of ways from point A to point to point B. So let's try to continue uh, this grid. Now at this point, uh, there is only one way, which is going to move right which is going to hit this one over here. So there is only one way to go from this point to point B. This one, we can move up to get this one, or we can move right to get this one. So in total, there will be two ways from this point to point B. This point, moving up, hits the three. Moving right, hits the one. So a total of four here. This point, you can only move to the right. So this will also be a four. This point going up will hit a 4, going right will hit you a 2, and there's a total of 6. So there's a total of 6 ways from this point to point B. Uh, this point going up hits a 1, going right hits a 3, so, oops, sorry. Going up hits a 1, going right hits a 3, so total of 4. This point going up hits a 4, going right hits a 4, a total of 8. This point going up hits a 1, going right hits an 8, so a total of 9. And finally, we can get how many ways are there from point A, which is this red point, to point B. 
going up hits a 9, going right hits a 6. So 9 plus 6, there is a total of 15 ways from point A to point B. And this will be our final answer. Hopefully you guys learned something new from this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!